Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a custom gradient in a very easy way. And I've learned this from Oregonian and she's a member of Kimptalk.com. And she also runs a little Kimp site and that's called Kimpchat.com. And this is a really nice little site, so check it out if you want to know a little bit more about Kimp. But now I'm going to show you how to make this custom gradient in a very easy way, like I said. First of all, you have to have your gradient tab open here. And if you don't have a gradient tab open, then just go to Windows, Dockable Dialogs and click on Gradients. And then either your tab or dialog will open and you're going to need this later. And now again, go to Windows, Dockable Dialogs and click Palettes. And this will open your color palettes and you need to create a new one. And you do this by clicking on this icon here and it says new palette. And by clicking on it, this new palette creator will be opened. And in here, you can change the name and I'm going to change it to Kim Tricks. And this will also be the name of my gradient. So name it any way you like it. And then we're going to add the colors of the gradient. And for this, all you need to do is change your foreground color to the colors you want to add. So I'm going to start with a nice blue. I'm going to change my foreground color to this color blue. And then I have to click on this icon here. And it says new color from foreground color. And then click on it. And this will be the first color in my gradient. And to add more colors, colors to your gradient, just change your foreground color. And I'm going to go with something pink. And then click on this icon again. And then pink will be your the second color of your gradient. And I'm going to add some more colors. And again, click on this icon and change my foreground color again. And this time I want a little bit green. And click on this icon. New color from foreground again. And I'm going to add a few more colors. Uh, bright pink one, maybe. Like this. Okay, and again, click on this icon here. And I want something blue, something very light blue, like this. And click like this. And again, just the foreground color, change the foreground color and click on this icon here. So my last one will be a darker blue, like this. And I'm going to click on this. And now these will be the colors in your gradient. And when you look at your palette dock here, you will see that there's a palette called Kim Tricks. And when you right click on this palette and click palette to gradient, it will automatically make a new gradient. And when you look in your blend tool here, then you will see your new gradient in your gradient here. And it's called Kim Tricks. And it will also be highlighted in your gradient dialog. And it's also called Kim Tricks. And if you want to edit, a little, edit it a little bit more, then right click on it and click Edit Gradient. And then this will appear. And this is your gradient editor. And you can edit it by moving the sliders here. To the right, to the left, every slider you want. So I'm going to move this slider a bit like this. And well, I actually like it, but you can play around with the sliders to customize your gradient even more. And now I'm done. Um, I'm done, sorry. And um, I'm going to close this and close this and close this. And now I'm going to create a new file. Just to show you what it looks like. And my gradient is still selected. So all I need to do is stroke from left to right. And this is my new gradient. And this is how easy you can make a custom gradient. A complicated custom gradient. And this is all thanks to Oregonian who taught me this at KimTalk.com. And I hope you liked this video. And if you did then maybe you'd like to watch my other videos and subscribe. And thank you for watching.